right, special night. Tonight is the full hunter's moon. The moon is going to appear as the biggest and brightest moon actually of the entire year. And News 2's meteorologist Alex Libby had a chance to speak with a local astronomer about what we can expect. Alex. Yeah, Mark, Dr. William Teets is the director of the Vanderbilt's Dyer Observatory in Brentwood. He says tonight's full moon will appear about 30% brighter than the typical moon. Dr. Teets says the moon's orbit is not a perfect circle, so there are times when it's closer and further away. He says tonight's full moon will be close to perigee, which is the term for when it's closest to Earth. He says that's why this moon tonight will be a little extra super. It was within, I think it was a few thousand kilometers of if it's closest uh, point that it can get to the Earth. So, yeah, this would be like the, the super, super moon, if you will. But, yeah, compared to like uh, the last super moon we had, you're probably not going to be able to notice any difference. He says when the moon is low in the sky, it will look even larger. He says it's an illusion that can make for the best photographs. Along with looking bigger, he says the moon will appear more yellow or orange just after it rises above the horizon. Moonrise tonight occurs at 542. Dr. Teet says this will, you'll be able to see this supermoon in the eastern sky when it rises, and then you'll still be able to see the comet in the western sky. Mark. 